To get three-dimensional data from objects, fringe projection profilometry makes use of phase-shifted fringes, a projector that projects those fringes onto the desired object, and a camera that retrieves images distorted by the object's depth profile. The phases are then wrapped into values from negative pi to pi and further unwrapped to get the absolute phase. This method is widely used due to its low-cost application, high speed, and high accuracy in reconstruction. With a multi-frequency temporal phase unwrapping method, fringes with different frequencies are used to be able to get more information from complex objects. What my thesis, multi-frequency fringe projection profilometry, virtual and real-world three-dimensional imaging, wants to see is which of three chosen different algorithms of multi-frequency FPP would work best, and would multi-frequency FPP hold in virtual and real-world setups. For the virtual setup, a free open source 3D computer graphics software, Blender, is used to model FPP, with a hemisphere, step height, and a Yoda figurine as the objects measured. Blender allows you to decide what to project, and you can also modify the surface properties of the objects. For the real world setup, a makeshift projector using a smartphone and a magnifying glass was used, with a hemisphere, step height, and a Lego figurine as the objects measured. The algorithms used were the standard three-step method, which uses three high and three low frequency fringe images, with a total of six fringe images. The bi-frequency method, which only uses two low frequency fringe images along with the three high frequency images, bringing its fringe image total up to five. And the dual frequency method, which also uses five fringe images, but with all containing both the frequencies. Findings show that Blender provided a better playing ground for testing 3D imaging algorithms, and it had less discrepancies than its real-world counterpart. Dual frequency method provided the best reconstruction quality as it boasted consistent phase values, clean depth profiles, and near-exact high values. Scan this QR code to register for my thesis defense or if you have any more inquiries.